Welcome back, traveler, Paimon, Balladeer. <sighs> it feels like we just went on a really long journey. Paimon's exhausted. <sighs> You don't like being addressed by that name? It's fine. But I was just thinking, I should probably change it. Du wirst nicht mehr Scaramouche genannt werden? Menschen ändern sich. Ja, aber er ist eine Puppe. After learning about everything the doctor did, there's no way I can carry on using a name connected to him. I'm not planning on returning to the Fatui. And they wouldn't take me back anyway. Recent events will have affected a lot of people. And they might not even remember who the sixth is. So you're quitting the Fatui for good? Das wäre eine heimliche Flucht. It's like you said, Lesser Lord Kusanali. Everything may look futile, but it wasn't completely meaningless. At least I made a lot of people forget about me. But that doesn't mean your own past has disappeared. Of course. And your main goal, for which you gave up everything you had, you weren't able to achieve it. I hope you can see and understand that. Changing the world, changing the past, changing the fates of other people, these are not simple things to accomplish. What you are looking for is complete annihilation. But this is just a fantasy. Even if the Balladeer is removed from existence, the world will not heed your will. Indeed. <laughs> How ridiculous. Do you regret doing all that when you've gotten so little in return? Even if I'm completely worthless, there's nothing in the world worth regretting. Lesser Lord Kusanali, you purposely left that information in Nermansol, didn't you? Yes. And I took pains to make sure that you'd acquire that information naturally. Why would you go to such lengths? You trying to win me over too? In all honesty, your past experiences have made you a useful asset to Sumeru and to me. Winning you over was indeed a part of my plan. But before that, I wanted to tell you the truth about your past. If all I wanted to do was use you, and I'd be no different from the doctor. Very clever. I guess you could say that's one of my virtues. Utility to others is what gives me worth. So if embracing my sins is what it takes to make me useful again, so be it. So take no, you don't need. Oh, right. I almost forgot. You're the good guys. You're into justice and all that. Sorry if I have a slightly different perspective on things, but I don't feel like I've been duped. The wisest leaders are fated to end up with the best helpers. I'm glad you're able to think of it in that way. Traveler, in the future, I'll continue to search Ermin's soul more deeply and see what secrets can be uncovered, including the beginning of your twin's journey recorded in Ermin's soul. What exactly happened before and after that point? I want to know as well. Und dann helfen wir das auch rauszufinden. I will try. Traveler. Hm. After I dove into the information torrent in Ermansol, why did you go to Inazuma? Weil ich wissen wollte, was du verändert hast. So that's how you found out whose fate had changed. And how? Well, whatever your reasons, you did me a favor. And I'll do everything I can to pay it back. Ich habe nicht getan, ich habe es nicht getan, um dich dafür dafür belohnt zu werden. Borrowing and returning are the only real relationships between individuals. I'll balance the books one day. Don't you worry. That's not true. A relationship between two people is not simply a ledger that can be reset to zero. I think deep down you realize this. People who show up in your life don't just evaporate like water drops and leave nothing behind. There is no such thing as balancing the books. Puppen ändern sich. Ja, das ist jetzt ein Staubahn. Oder Puppen fallen ins Feuer und verändern sich zu Asche. Das nennt man dann die Gesignora, wenn sie zu Asche werden. Some things in this world can never be brought back. And they can never be changed. Which is why there is emotion in the human world. Everything that you feel is real and lasting. And whatever is missing in you will not be made whole. To be human is to live with imperfections. 
You can choose whether or not you want to be human. Hmm. But humans can't live without a heart, can they? Anyway, I gave up trying to become a human a long time ago. You understand what pain is perfectly well, even without a heart. You're just bearing your feelings. The past is set in stone, but you can keep moving on. And the longer your future lasts, the shorter your past will become, until one day, it is but a tiny fraction of your life. It sounds like you've got a future planned out for me. Ich hoffe, du wirst dich mit Nahida zusammentun. Everything's ended up being pretty darn complicated. Paimon doesn't even know where to start, but... The most important thing now is that you need to follow Nahida. Otherwise, all our efforts will have been for nothing. <lacht> ich gehe einfach weg. Tschüss. Feierabend. Then I guess I'll be helping you from behind the scenes from now on. <laughs> I'm glad that you've accepted our proposal. Why don't you choose a new name to celebrate? Oh, oh, oh! Paimon wants to pick an ugly nickname for you too. <laughs> Paimon is gleich wieder voll dabei. Why? Because, because Paimon still doesn't like you that much. <laughs> <laughs> then I hope we don't see much of each other in the future. A name is life's first gift. You didn't say it out loud, but I know that's what you're thinking. <sighs> the Traveler and Paimon have helped you a lot. If you can't decide on a new name, maybe you can ask them for ideas. No, Paimon only does nicknames. If it's a serious name you're after, it's all yours. <laughs> das geht nicht. Paimon kann nur Spitznamen vergeben. Wie geil. Darf ich jetzt? Have you got anything? Uh, Regeln zur Namensänderung. Kannst du Namen Figur bis in Ewigkeit driften? Wandere Animo durch das Zwischenkapitel. Namen geändert wurde. Zeigen bestimmte Teile der Spieloberfläche den angepassten Namen an. <lacht> war das schon immer so, dass da so viel Zeug war? Ja. War das so? Oh nee, dann doch so. Mach mal Yama. Zu so den Yamabushi. Wegen Wanderer. Ja, finde ich gut. Oh, all right. If you say so. You have a name of your own. What about a nickname? Are you done yet? Uh, I... Still thinking. Stop rushing me! Take your time. I don't need to see you again until you've thought of one. Just the four. Everyone who manipulated me and made me suffer will have to pay the price. You mean the Fatui? The doctor, at least. Now that your stance has changed, I believe your future path will change accordingly. But it won't be immediate. You still need some time to compose yourself. Hmm. One more thing. There are still some descendants of the Raiden Gokuden living in Inazuma. Some of them know. Well, they ought to know about the connection between Raiden Gokuden and myself. I don't plan to leave Sumeru for the time being. If you see them in Inazuma, please tell them that I was the one responsible for the Raiden Gokuden's downfall. Even though the events have been erased from the world, they still deserve to know the truth. I see. That is up to you. Huh? But if we do that, then... It's fine. Let them stab their blades into my chest if they so desire. Maybe that's how it always should have been. Ich verstehe. <lacht> no nonsense. I like it. All right. Let's call it a day. 
Goodbye, wise deity. And you too. He's gone! What he went through today would have been like living an entire lifetime in an instant. He'll need some time to calm down. Yeah, true. But even so, after everything that's happened, he doesn't seem quite as fierce anymore. Jedenfalls ist es jetzt vorbei. So we can finally go eat? Paimon is starving. <lacht> Thank you both. I hope you will find somewhere nice to go and relax for a while. I've got it! I can end my novel with some words from Mikoshi Nagamasa. You mean because everyone else in the story is dead? Yeah, I heard that Mikoshi Nagamasa died at a ripe old age. He's the perfect fit to be the narrator of the epilogue. The dark clouds had dissipated, but they continued to cast their shadow in Mikoshi Nagamasa's mind for decades to come. Then, one night, as an old man, he had a dream. On the night when that prized blade, the Daitatara Nagamasa, was forged, the people rejoiced, and there was painting, dancing, and drinking. All these expressions of joy melted down in the furnace fire and turned into red clouds that rallied around the final sunrise that Mikoshi Nagamasa saw in his lifetime. Life is a story too long to be told, a journey that you must walk to behold. <laughs> Geht zum Ruheplatz zurück. Ja, da muss ich ihm keinen hässlichen Namen geben. Ich hab's schon überlegt, aber... Geht gar nicht den Namen der anderen Schaus. Stimmt, ja, man kann ihn zum Beispiel auch nicht mehr Scaramouche nennen oder, oder Lumine oder solche Sachen. Also habe ich bloß mal was gesehen, dass das nicht geht. Aber die Frage ist, wenn du von Bennett einfach einen Tee weglässt und dann irgendwie so, ob das dann geht, das würde mich interessieren. Kann man ruhig ordentlich aus. Ich werde dir zur Belohnung etwas Leckeres kaufen. Wow, great! Huh? Look at the vase! Was ist? Did someone break it while they were cleaning the room or something? Like, Paimon doesn't remember there being a cleaner. In jener Nacht war Paimon wegen der Sache mit Skarmut verängstigt und ist aus Versehen an den Tisch gestoßen und hat die Flamme zerbrochen. Aber gleich danach hat Skarmusch seine Ex eigene Existenz ausgelöscht. Hat er die Welt nicht schon verändert? Warum ist diese Flasche dann immer noch zerbrochen? You sound lost and confused. Mister. I know why you are troubled. Any who knew of this would find their mind overwhelmed. Huh? Is this the one you're talking to us? Unfortunately, the fate of Tevat cannot easily be changed. Perhaps a god may have a slim chance, but for anyone else, who can say? When a small animal runs into a tree trunk, though the tree may sway, it is not displaced. The same is true of fate. Like a vase that falls to the ground, whether it is broken by a cat or by a bird, the result is still a broken vase, is it not? Uh, who are you? How do you know about all this? History does not change easily, but human hearts can. Believe your own eyes. Only that which you see is true. What is unseen is but an illusion. Oh, ich mag die Stimme irgendwie. Fuck, Alter, ich will jetzt wissen, wie sie aussehen wird. Ja, 
den Augen vertrauen? Das hat sie gesagt. Soll ich auf meine Erinnerung hören? Was erwartet mich in der Zukunft? Umgekehrte Schöpfung, Zwischenkapitel abgeschlossen. Umschreibepinsel. Warte, was? Was ist das? Warte, was? Kann ich von jedem den Namen ändern? Pinsel, wenn der Namen einer Person geändert werden kann. Durch, nach Durchführung dieses Namensänderung ist keine weitere Änderung mehr möglich. Ja, das ist der Tester. Nutzungsbedingungen, Mobbing, bla bla bla, wir können uns im Spiel ins Einstrengen. Ja, finde ich jetzt auch, dass es schon ziemlich früh kommt, dass du jetzt da schon vom anderen Arkon was erfährst. Also wenn es ist, wird halt wahrscheinlich zu 90% so schon so sein. Ich muss aber, ich finde aber persönlich, es wirkt ein bisschen, wie sagt man, einfallslos, wenn jetzt das der neue Arkon schon wieder war. Weil ich meine, das ist ja im Prinzip genau dasselbe, was mit, mit, mit der Nahida jetzt gewesen ist. Die hat ja uns, mit uns auch einfach über das eine Gerät geredet, das ist eigentlich ja fast dasselbe. Oder stehen die Arkons jetzt schon überall Schlange, um mit uns zu reden? Jetzt bin ich dran, ich darf mit ihm reden. Los, geh weg vom Telefon. Das Marketing, ja. Das Marketing von Traveler ist zu gut. <lacht> Jeder kennt ihn schon, will schon gleich mit ihm reden. Ich war nicht, bis er bei mir im verdammten Land ist, Alter. Ich will jetzt mit ihm reden. Ja, also sogar ich muss zugeben, dass Skara ist jetzt nicht mehr ganz so schlimm wie vorher, aber wenn er noch immer ein ziemliches cheeky Arschloch ist. <lacht> Oder ein voll lauter Penner. Mann, die Held. Der ist nicht mal ein Held in seinen verdammten Träumen. Herren. Nee, das war sie, glaube ich, nicht. Die ist ja komplett ausgelöscht. Das wäre ja komisch, wenn die mit uns reden würde. Ein Anti-Anti 1% hält. Nee, nachdem er angestellt hat, kann er nicht mal ein Anti-Held sein. Weil Anti-Held ist ja im Prinzip. Er ist zwar ein guter, aber er nimmt ziemlich üble. üble, üble ähm, er bringt auch Leute um, wenn es sein muss oder sowas. Das wäre ein Anti-Held, aber nach dem, was er halt vorher alles schon angestellt hat, also seine letzte Existenz, kannst du ihn halt schon nicht mal als Anti-Helden hinstellen. Du kannst ihn nächstens als... Fuck, da fällt mir jetzt dazu nichts ein. Dass jetzt eher schon mal auf so einer Wiedergutmachungsrunde ist. Wie lange hat jetzt das noch gedauert? Ja, 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 das letzte Mal sagen, es dauert nicht mehr lange, 20 Minuten. Das war jetzt, das war fast jetzt, das war eine Dreiviertelstunde jetzt, was das noch gedauert hat. Schon gewusst, wo du letztes Mal aufgehört hast. Okay, er macht jetzt Therapie. Genau, er muss jetzt erst einmal in Therapie. Also muss ein paar Sitzungen machen. So. Jetzt haben wir dann eigentlich dann bloß noch als nächstes Akitsuko Modameshi. Wobei das stimmt ja eigentlich auch nicht, ne? Ich habe ja noch einen Haufen anderen Scheiß zu machen. Na, hier habe ich noch nicht mal freigeschalten. Und den Heiso muss ich auch noch irgendwann mal machen. Sag mal, gab's denn jetzt eigentlich irgendwas mit der... mit der Farusan? Oder hat die so geheißen? Ja. 
Ja. Taucht die eigentlich irgendwo auf? Das kommt mir gerade erst von der ist ja eigentlich nichts, außer dass es viel Sterne Charakter ist. Und auf dem neuen Event wird sie ja auch nicht sein, oder? Die sind, die sind doch ein. Ist nicht ein Charakter aus äh, Sumeru? Ist da bei der Quest eigentlich schon alles freigeschalten? Bei der da? Und da muss man auch bestimmte Tageszeit warten, bis das alles freigeschalten ist. Probe des Mutes. Das heißt, dass die Probe des Mutes jetzt durchgeführt wird. Geht zur Yashiro Verwaltung, sieh nach, was da los ist. Na gut, fangen wir damit doch einfach an. Ach komm, muss man auswählen. Sonst nervt es bloß. Nur das Minigame ist so lala. Äh, da. Halt, wo laufe ich eigentlich hin? Das mit die richtig nice. Lange nicht gesehen. Ah, it's you two. Yes, it has been a while. <lacht> we heard the Yashiro Commission is holding a test of courage, so we came right over to sign ourselves up. We didn't expect to see you here in person, though. Does that mean this event is really important? You think I only make an appearance for occasions that are deemed sufficiently important? <laughs> It just so happens that this test of courage event was actually my suggestion. But naturally, I've left the planning and more trifling details to be arranged by my retainers. Considering that such events are quite popular across Tevat, I've had numerous examples to draw from, so everything should be in good order. I'm merely here to do a routine check on the progress of the event. That's all. Oh, Paimon gets it! So what you're saying is, you're not very busy right now. <laughs> In that case, maybe you can give us a quick rundown of the event rules! <laughs> Only Paimon could be so natural at ordering others around. Hast du die geborene Kommandantin? Das steht noch unten dabei. However... The possibility remains that we may yet require your assistance. Uh, sorry. What did you say? <laughs> ah, nothing. <laughs> Seeing as I apparently have some time, I suppose we may chat about the event for a moment. Yippee! Vielen Dank. As its name implies, the event is a game designed to put one's courage to the test. The venue for the event will be set up in the Chinju Forest, Before the start of each round, participants will be divided into teams of two. Once teams have been formed, the event staff will announce the name of an item that has been placed in or around the Chinju Forest area. The first person to locate the specified item will be declared the winner of that round. The winner of that round? Huh. So there's going to be multiple rounds to the Test of Courage? Precisely. There will be a total of three rounds in the Test of Courage because the event was actually orchestrated by three different parties. Merchants raised event funding, the Kamisato clan provided the grounds, and the Grand Narukami Shrine provided consulting services. As such, each of these three parties have selected one item for participants to find. So, naturally, the event will require three rounds to determine the winners. Gets it? So basically, it boils down to searching for stuff in Chinju Forest. We'll need to find one item each round for a total of three items after three rounds. Huh. Simple enough for Paimon. <laughs> yes, seems you've got the gist of it. We will be issuing different rewards based on the number of rounds won. So, if a participant wins multiple rounds, then that will also be reflected in their final reward. If a participant manages to find all three items, then they shall receive the grand prize provided by the Grand Narukami Shrine. Uh-oh. Ooh, a grand prize? Sounds like it could be really valuable. 
As for its true value, I'm afraid you'll have to win the event first and ask Lady Guji yourself. Of course, this event is intended to measure your courage. If you withdraw from the event because you become too frightened, then you might as well forget about seeing any rewards. I'm curious myself how many people will be brave enough to make it to the end. It'll be most disappointing if nobody claims the prizes we've prepared. Don't worry, those prizes are as good as ours! <laughs> Fine, Mom. Even though just the thought of this event sends shivers down Paimon's little spine, the Traveler will be brave enough, no doubt about that. What? Just again, that's what. I appreciate your enthusiasm. <laughs> I look forward to seeing how you perform. Anyway, I think I've given you sufficient details. I'll add your names to the list of participants momentarily. As for the three items you'll be searching for, please wait for a staff member to inform you at the start of the event. Oh, and a friendly word of advice. Test of courage events tend to give rise to a variety of strange rumors and stories. So please, be sure to exercise caution. Whoa, what did I mean by that? Oh, will there be spooky things in Tindu Forest? Feel like. Ah! Oh, now even you're trying to scare Pine. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we got an event to win. Grand prize, here we come. Oh my god, ich habe Angst, aber es gibt Luxusgegenstand, also los geht's. Okay, zu kommen hat er mir Komodameshi 1. Vorhin habe ich es einfach locker vorgelesen, jetzt ist es einfach weg gewesen.